gentlemen, introducing the one, the only, Amir of Appetite, Caliph of Cuisine, the Sultan of Snack. Guys, today I'm going to be trying out something I've never tried before, chicken salad chick. Now, I'm not personally too big on chicken salad, but I heard this was pretty good. So let's go inside, give it a shot. I've got here Lauren's lemon basil on a croissant pasta salad. And we're going to see what it's all about. It has some watermelon, sweet tea. Okay. You need to get something. Yeah, I'm gonna get the little octopus. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Smells very herbaceous. Yeah. Okay, let's give it a shot. Is that good? Meadow cheese? Spicy. Yeah. Oh, spicy. Meadow cheese. This is good. Really straightforward. Mm -hmm. You feel the hint of the basil. Almost tastes minty, you know? See, strong basil. Nice little linen finish. I didn't opt for the lettuce and tomato because I just wanted it straight up. It's good. Good salt level too, like it's not under season. Good croissant. I would get that again. I don't consider myself the biggest chicken salad person or anything, but it's good. Who'd have thought you'd have an entire chain based on it? That's good, and I think they make these in-house like every morning. They make all the varieties. So how's the pimento cheese? Is it up there in terms of pimento cheese that you've had in different places? Top shelf? Um, let's see, pimento cheese. It's just a hint, so it's definitely the appropriate amount. That's really quality the pimento cheese, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Just a hint of spice? Yeah, as you would expect. Mm -hmm. How's the pasta salad? It's okay. See what it's about. A pork. Pasta salad. It does the job. Yeah. That's what I'm expecting. <laughs> I don't mind it uh, this dry. I kind of like it like that. But I know some people, they don't want it to be like a lot of the vinaigrette, a lot, like, a lot of dressing. I don't, I don't really want that, you know what I'm saying? Good? Yeah, I like it. It sounds weird because I prefer it on the dry end, but yeah. It doesn't gotta be swimming in the, in the dressing. A little olive in there for your baby. 
bustling in here too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's pretty good. Watermelon sweet tea. It's not too sweet. It's got the watermelon flavor. It's not my favorite thing in the world, but it's a nice change up. So everywhere I go, when I see watermelon tea, I can't resist.